Hello everyone. I hope y'all are doing amazing today. I am here to share with you some quick tips on how to maximize a flavor release. Today happens to be a day that we do have a flavor coming, but I know some of you might see this later and use this for uh, future info when a flavor is coming. So one thing that I love about Prove It is the flavor drops. I love how they do that. It's really fun. It's really exciting. Um, it's exciting for our customers, right? And it just, it just makes it fun. So um, sometimes when we're lucky, we get a little heads up when something's coming. And so when that happens, we are, it gives us the opportunity to be able to maximize that and just kind of get ready for it and maybe get a list built up and look and see who's ordered in the past, who's been interested, who had it in a trial pack. And so the better we are at, you know, really documenting that stuff and then also being able to go find it, which I'm going to show you how to do now, um, the better, because then when it comes, it's like, Hey, it's live and boom, you can go, you can put your messages out and you can have the word out to everybody really, really quickly. Instead of having to scramble around when we don't know it's coming, which that definitely happens sometimes too, but just a couple quick things. So when this does happen and we get the word that something's coming, we're not actually allowed to post and say, Hey, this is coming today, right? Like publicly, we're not really supposed to say that. So that's why we talk about just teasing it. So I'm actually going to go in and show you really quick um, how you guys bear with me because I am like not the most techie person in the world. I'm going to share my screen and I'm going to show you how to look in your back office. Let me move this out of the way. How to look in your back office and find who ordered um, who ordered from you in the past. Let's see. Let me go here. All right, so what you're going to do is you'll log into your Prove It Cloud. And then once you get in there, which I already had it up somewhere, but hold on one second. Let me switch over here. Okay, here we go. All right, so here we are. We're in our Prove It Cloud. And when you're in your back office, and by the way, my screen may be just a little bit delayed. It happens sometimes when we screen share on Zoom. Um, but we're going to go in and we're going to go to Manage. We're going to go to Community. Once you get there, and this is set to personal right now. So uh, for me, I this is my personal community. This is what I want to look at right now. But if you're someone who maybe has a couple promoters, maybe your team is, is in the beginning stages of growing and you have a couple promoters and they have some customers and they're not really sure how to do all this yet, right? Maybe they're just customers that share and they have, they have a, a huge you know, five, 10 customers under them. If you want to look at your whole community to see this information, all you have to do is go here and go to community, sponsorship tree community. Um, and then, but I'm just going to go to personal here and then you're going to go over to insights and insights is where we can dig deep into what we want to find. So we're going to go to order history. We're going to go to filter. And then right here where it says product name, we're going to put in sweet tea. And we're going to see what comes up. Let's see. Sometimes it takes a minute because you may have a lot of people. Okay, here we go. Sweet tea lemonade. So now I've got all the names of everyone who ordered sweet tea lemonade last time it was available. These are people that I can go to and say, hey, I saw that you ordered sweet tea lemonade the last time it was available. I wanted to let you know that it's I think it's coming back today. I've heard it's coming back today. So just keep an eye out and, you know, make sure you grab some because it's amazing and we don't know exactly when it's going to come back. Okay. So that's in the back office. Um, and again, if you want to look in your whole community, you can, and you can talk to your, your customers or your promoters, let them know so they can let their people know. Now I'm going to take you over to Facebook here. Okay. So on Facebook, I'll actually, I'm going to open up Facebook Messenger. And on Facebook Messenger, what we are able to do is, let me just go here. Okay, so we're able to actually search keywords and keyword searches are huge, huge, huge for, for so many things. Um, yes, of course you can use this picture, yes. So this is huge because um, like for Dollar Keto Club, I searched the word opportunity, business, promoter, and I was able to pull up all these conversations. So sweet tea lemonade. Now, before you do this, let me just back up real quick. So before you do this part, it's good to go out and put a teaser on your Facebook page. So if you have, if you have this, 
Um, if you, you have drank it before, put something like a picture of it that says, oh my gosh, this flavor is amazing. Or I can't believe there's a sweet tea lemonade, you know, flavor of ketones. I love it. Like this is the best. I, something along those lines where you can just tease it, but don't say like it's coming today. Just say, are you a sweet tea lemonade fan? And then you can make your list there of those people. So if you put your post out, now you have something teasing teasing while you're in the background working and actually pulling conversations. But when you do that, just keep in mind when you post on Facebook, and this is such a good thing to remember all the time, is that Facebook is very smart and the algorithm is very smart and they have words that they look for. I cannot, I cannot stress this enough, you guys. It's so important because I see it happen so many times, all the time it happens, all the time. And I'm like, ah, because you're making the effort to make a post, but if you put words on there and Facebook picks up that you're selling something, if you're sometimes even just saying, hey, message me if you want a trial, like that right there can throw it all, throw the whole thing out. And you look at your post and you're like, why did nobody see that? Why did nobody, no, nobody wants my ketones? No, they just didn't see it because Facebook said, wait a minute, you didn't pay me to advertise. So I'm not going to put your, I'm not, I'm not here to make you money. That's what Facebook said, right? So keep that in mind. Never, ever, ever put a link never ever ever put a sales flyer like it's just not going to work and the other thing is even when it comes down to typing something on facebook space it a little bit indent your paragraph like think about when you're scrolling the timeline if you see something if you see a post that's just like four sentences no indention no nothing just boop there it is do you stop and read that? Like, do you take, what makes you stop and read that? Right. And then, and then on the other side of it, you also don't want, we all can recognize a salesy post too, right? We all, we all can. And so those are things that you want to keep in mind when you're posting. And if you haven't gotten to the point yet where you're good with coming up with something like that, or if you feel like you need a little bit of help with how, with how to do that, the only way to get good at it is to practice, right. And to ask for help. So ask us, say, Hey, I'm trying to come up with a way to do this. Do you have any ideas? And then we can help you. And before you know it, you're going to be a master at it. Okay. So let me move this over. Hold on. Little screens in my way. Okay. So back to messenger now. So I, oh, goodness sake, let me go over here. See, I told y'all I'm not, not super techie. Okay. So let's go on here. Cause I don't know how to do it in the app. We're going to make this large and then we're going to search well, look, it brought me right back to the same place. Okay, so sweet tea. Let's see what comes up if I do sweet tea. All right, so it's only showing me three messages, which I know that that's not the case. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to go back. I'm going to stop sharing my screen here. I'm going to go back over to Zoom and I'm going to show you on my phone. Let me just turn this down. And the speaker view so this you can get your phone you can actually do this with me um speaker okay so on your phone what you want to do is you want to go into the your text messages and in your text messages on the top in the search bar type in sweet tea just type in sweet tea right and so when you type in sweet tea and it brings up these messages and then you can hit see all when you hit see all, you're going to see all the messages where you talked about sweet tea. So the, some words that you can search are sweet tea, sweet tea lemonade, Arnold Palmer. Um, and of course, these some of you are like, I've never posted anything about anything because I, um, I don't, I've never even tried this stuff. That's okay. Okay, right now I'm talking to the people that have had these conversations. So you can do that on text message. You can also do that on messenger. So when I open messenger, I can go to search. I am in someone's chat. Okay, I can go right here to search. Hopefully you guys can see this and I can do the same thing. Sweet tea, I'm just putting sweet tea and then you go see more. That's the part I wasn't seeing on my computer for some reason. So see more and I've got all these conversations where we talked about sweet tea and I can go in and let people know, hey, I know we talked about sweet tea last time, sweet tea lemonade. I think it's coming back today. I wanted to make sure I let you know so that if you wanna grab a box or five, <laughs> or hey, if you want a trial pack too, if you want a trial pack, let me know. If you wanna buy five or 10 off of me, let me know. Like, you know, you'll know what your best thing is to, op to offer people, okay? I will say, I will strongly encourage 
um, you to, I just thought of something else I wanted to show you. I'm gonna go back over here to share my screen. Um, something else, um, oh, buy extra of it because no matter how great you do with putting the word out here, there's gonna be, there are gonna be people that miss it and we don't know how long it's gonna be here. So you're always gonna be able to sell it, okay? So just, if you can buy a couple extra boxes, definitely do that. If it's something that you're like, well, I can't put the money out unless I know 100% for sure that it's going to be back like tomorrow, then pre-sell it. Tell people, okay, if you want 10 packs, I can sell it to you. And then you should maybe wait and see, you know, when it drops, are you getting it at a discount? Like, do you want to consider that in your trial pack price? But just say, hey, I'll put you on my list and then I'll get back to you later on this afternoon. And then just be prepared yourself to be able to buy that. Um, you can also search your post. Um, so if you do, and hopefully this is going to participate with me on here with a filter, but on your phone, you can do it too. If you search up in the search bar, you're going to have a filter button right here and you can search. So I'm going to search post for these keywords, Arnold Palmer, and then look what comes up. A video I did about Arnold, Arnold that sweet tea lemonade, we'll just call it that. I can go into my comments and I can see who all commented and said, that sounds amazing. I want to try it, blah, blah, blah. Here we go. I see Izzy posted it. Okay, and then I can even get more specific and I can go posted from you, which is where I want to see ju just the post that I made about it. And then I can go, oh, li look, life's a peach. This was like back in 2019, but I can go to my people that had life's a peach and I can tell them about it. Um, so. Here we go, sweet tea lemonade, like 36 comments. These are all people that we can reach out to. So hopefully hopefully you get it. Hopefully that gives you lots of ideas and you can get on that right away because usually stuff will drop around 11 or so. So um, that's gonna be soon. That's an hour, about, about an hour from right now um, in Eastern time. So let me look at my notes real quick. Don't say when waiting lists are huge. Listen, if you're like an Excel person or a notebook person or a Google person, and you can keep a running list of who likes what flavor, that is so, so, so good because I'm the type that I haven't, I'm not that organized with my life yet. I've got lists in different places and I've got some notepads in my phone of, of ones in the past. But at this point, this is my method of doing this is just going through and searching. So if you're newer and you haven't done this yet, just be excited. Just be excited. Oh my gosh. You guys have seen, I've been, I told you the other day, I've been drinking these ketones and they're really, really good. But I just heard that there's a sweet tea lemonade flavor um, coming out soon. That sounds amazing. Like who are my sweet tea lovers or who are my sweet tea lemonade lovers or something along those lines. Again, we can work with you one-on-one -on -one to help you with the right language. Um, but you, you know, put something out there with excitement, get a feel for who would want to try it. And then just go ahead and order extra too, because it's going to help you number one, and let us help you with the best way to do that for your commissions and your bonuses and everything. Um, but it's also going to, I'm telling you this, this flavor is so good. No, like people love this flavor. So you're going to be able to get a lot of people hooked and hopefully one day this will be a mainstay um, for this particular one. But yeah, grab extra, get it out there. You're not going to have a problem getting rid of it. So with that, I think that was kind of the main things that I just wanted to share on. So hopefully you got some great tips from that. I'm going to let you go do your thing and I'm going to go search and get in touch with some people. So y'all have an awesome day. We'll see you soon. Bye.